Hi Shyam, this is Shriram. I'm recording this video to show uh, my understanding about the relationship between uh, ragam, swaras and uh, song. I took Chalanate Ragam as you are saying. Uh, I uh, try to understand the Ragam. I try to understand the Swaras that are, in, that are uh, used in this Ragam. And uh, then I was trying to uh, look up the, the song that you have, uh, um, uh, the, uh, the song that you have already uh, uploaded in YouTube, which is Panivira Malarvanam song. And I was trying to understand how these Swaras uh, of this Ragam are being used over there. So let me talk a little bit about Chalanate Ragam. Chalanate Ragam is the 36th uh, uh, Ragam of uh, the 72 Melakathas uh, that we have. And uh, obviously this is the 36th one. So this is the last one which uses Ma 1. And the 37th, from 37th it uses uh, Ma 2. Um, so the Swaras that are involved in this Ragam are uh, Sa, Ritri, Gatri, Ma 1, Pa, Datri, Nitri, Sa. That is Arohanam and Avarohanam is exactly the reverse of it. Sa, Nitri, Datri, Pa, Mavan, Gatri, Ritri, Sa. So let me uh, play the Arohanam uh, in uh, guitar using the E, B, G strings. This is to show that I, I can understand or I, I see the understanding of the Swaras and how they are mapped to the guitar uh, frets. So, Sa. Ritri, Gatri, Mavan, Pa, Datri, Nitri, Sa. Our honum is Sa, Nitri, Datri, Pa, Mavan, Datri, Ritri, Sa. So, uh, now that I have uh, talked about uh, the ragam and the swaras and how they are mapped to guitar, so let me talk a little bit about. Uh, Panivira uh, Malarvanam song. Um, so this song is exactly in Chalanate Ragam. And uh, uh, so uh, the next part of this video, uh, I'm, I'm going to talk about, uh, or I'm going to play the phrase of the uh, song and uh, then talk about the notes so that it kind of uh, shows that I have memorized the notes. And I'm, I'm able to fluently talk about uh, the notes uh, or the swaras to you. So the first, let me play the first phrase. So this is sa, sa. This is sa, and then this one is gatri, mavan, pa, mavan, pa, mavan, gatri. So that's phrase one. Phrase two is about uh, the same thing. Um, so this is how the phrase 2 plays out so the swaras that are involved uh, in phrase 2 are sa gatri mavan slide here and then go to the e string uh, third fret which is actually pa so this is pa and this is also pa so b string uh, uh, this is also pa and e string this is also pa so from pa slide until like sa pa sa nitri sa so these are the notes that are involved uh, uh, in the in that part and then followed by pa so pa datri pa mavan pa mavan gatri this is how so this is Dhatri in this section. So that's phrase two. So phrase two is about uh, Sa, Gatri, Mavan, Pa, Sa, Nitri, Sa, and then Pa, Dhatri, Pa, Mavan, Pa, Mavan, Gatri. So that's phrase two again. I just revisited the same thing. So phase three is about Selai Moodum. So this is uh, again the same things, same swaras. Nitri, sa, and then followed by pa. So same thing. And then I'm still in phrase three. Okay. So this is about from 
पा स्लाइड टू दात्री ऐसे वा सेइंग बिफोर इन चलनाटे रागम दात्री इज देयर राइट सो स्लाइडिंग अंटिल दात्री एंड देन पा ओके एंड सो दैट्स फ्रेज 3 मूविंग ऑन टू फ्रेज 4 फ्रेज 4 इज अबाउट So that's phrase four. So the swaras that are involved in phrase four are um, ni tri sa. This one is re tri. So this one is something new. So we never uh, used re tri anywhere. So this is the first time that we are using sa. This one is re two and re tri, right? So sa re tri, and then so they're using re two to re tri slide. Uh, re two for adding flavor. a little bit of flavor to this uh, uh, to the song even though the re2 is not perfectly there in chalana de ragam only re3 is there so that's actually phrase 4 so once we are uh, uh, moving on to phrase 5 phrase 5 is a very interesting phrase uh, this is how it comes so looking at the swaras that are involved for this phrase 5 uh, this is gatri maavan how is this gatri this is gatri because uh, this is re3 this is gatri so again gatri is there in chalana de ragam gatri maavan pa gatri pa maavan so this is how it comes Those are the swaras, and then followed by this is again we know this one. This is more about ma, ma one, pa, ma one, pa, ma one, and then this is gatri, ma one, gatri, and then this is re three. You can call this as re three, or uh, you can call this as gatu, because this is gatri, so this should be gatu. Uh, however, like gatu is not something that is there in Chalanate. They call us re three, and that's why uh, we stick to re three, right? So this is re three and re three two sad slide. So that's the last phrase. So uh, yeah, so that's about it. I mean, I just wanted to. um record this video and send it to you so that uh, you know i can i want to be exhibit or show to you um that i can understand about chalanate ragam and uh, the swaras involved in chalanate ragam and uh, how uh, the swaras uh, those swaras are actually used for uh, composing panyure malavanam song as you have already shown in your video thank you please uh, you know have a um uh, please feel free to provide feedback and uh, let me know like you know if something that i'm doing wrong or right or something like that thank you